basically Sevler is a global player as you know like we are into IC engine but looking forward to go for this uh, future uh, uh, emerging markets and future uh, trend also. So in EV, I mean so that is why if you see here there are three part of this pavilion. One is which is the old IC engine where we have this low canina which is the conventional product which we have and then there are some chassis product which is whether it is EV or IC it is going to help us in uh, everywhere and then we are showing this EXL and all which is the future technology. So uh, in this uh, so what we could see is maybe not today but going forward maybe after two three years this European market is going to evolve about this e-technology and all. So that is why we are wanted to, you know, ahead of this technology and we wanted to be there in that uh, ecosystem to help customers and to support them with our uh, technology R&D for the best services. So, uh, see, th thermal management systems, basically we are having these pumps, different kind of pumps which are of that current technology which is that uh, uh, for this fluid systems to, uh, be, even in EV you need to cool down because of this when this uh, uh, rotation happens when this uh, battery transport this uh, 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 electric systems to the uh, uh, rotor or maybe wheel it generates some heat so for that we are having this uh, thermal management system to uh, help to make it cool so that the temperature should be at a constant level. So that we are doing for different different type. I mean we are having this EV thermostat also, IC also. So again as I said like the technology which is current running and the future technology. So both we have this thermal management system Correct. where we are helping this Volkswagen and other uh, uh, different uh, customers for these systems, thermal management systems. Oh, yeah. yeah, I mean, see, earlier this used to have this aftermarket. So there were, I mean, so why we have changed it? Because we have categorized now VLS, as you rightly said, like, you know, till the time that uh, vehicle will survive, we will support them with the product and the services into it so that is why i mean if you are here then you can see here at this corner there is a service setup also so not only we are providing now the product to the customer we are trying to help them the services also like in e excel if you see the entire excel so we are helping them to service to the rotor motor also as well as the uh, this uh, gearbox also yeah. so whatever parts and that is why we have made a small small kits to help the customer to save their cost of repairing and at least people can use them and we are uh, supporting them with our uh, technology and knowledge we are training them and we are trying to develop those product which will help them to fit at the uh, iam i mean independent aftermarket as well as this oes people As this India is a growing market now, so some of the European cars are already increasing in numbers, right? And if you go a little back, this uh, trend of buying European cars was not that much, though the people had money, but they were not buying it because of the service facility and the cost of buying those products were little higher. So there was a fear into that ecosystem that if I buy a European car, maybe I will not get the product. Yeah. Maybe I will not get the proper service of it. So that is why people were not buying. Now the trend has changed. So the second hand cars, I mean if you see the resale of those cars are very high. And in India now it is like if, if the people buying, I mean like 4 million cars, OEM is selling. And at the same time, the same count of cars are resale also. So that service things are increasing into the market. So that is why Sevler is providing all these European product and services to Indian market. Now and that is why I said I mean that's future also like we are already into Tata Motors for this EXL 
which we are going to deliver we are already in test phase it is already working and we were the first company who got this almost 300 million 2700 near crore uh, order from Tata Motors so I mean we are already into EXL and all but not for the cars I mean past cars but we have started with uh, Tata oh, Motors commerce as well. I mean, uh, see this VLS India is taking care of uh, all the services. I mean, after sales services of all the product, whether it is two wheeler, four wheeler, and tractors. Right. The focus area currently from our side is the CV business, CV and the tractor. Because the tractor, you know that India now it's past two three years is going very fast. Right. And the numbers of tractors has increased. You mean the agriculture? Agriculture tractors. So. Uh, that that has increased and now they need to be serviced properly with the so now the buyers even earlier it was a myth that the uh, farmers of India are not a good pair but what we can visualize is they always want a good product only they were not getting those products Right. So, I mean, if, if you see this Indian context, we have two kind of product. One is the core product, which is like Lokina and FAG. Another one, which is the True Power. True Power is a brand which we have established in 2020. Right. And we are building that brand. And those brands are basically the consumables. Yeah. Though we are highly focused on our core strength, core competency, at the same time, we are trying to build this True Power brand also as well into Indian market for the consumables. So, our target is majorly to 80-85% should be the, our core products always. In even going future, we are not going to reduce it or defocus from our core strength to the True Power brand, right? But at the same time, this True Power brand is basically helping us to promote this several as a brand because the product which of core goes into that vehicle inside which is not seen by the consumers Sorry. whereas if you see this wiper or maybe batteries or lubricant so it is giving you a visual uh, uh, appearance, appearance into the market which is helping us to build our brand so this is one thing and now as this ev is growing slowly we are uh, feel is that maybe not today but going forward maybe this IC engine this transmission and gearbox may not be there into the vehicle so we are trying to develop that capacity also so that we can have this steering and suspension product which is again as I said these products will be always there whether it is IC engine or uh, uh, electric engine so I mean whether it is electric vehicle or IC engine, that uh, steering and suspension product will always be there. So in core also this bearing and steering will be there. Maybe transmission uh, component like clutch and uh, dual, mass, dual mass flywheels, those things may not be available at that time. So our focus area is still our core strength and at the same time we are trying to build our brand through two power for the visibility purpose, which is giving us a core strength. So, uh, as far as true power is concerned, most of the product we are developing in India only. So, I mean, it is nothing that true power we are building that brand and we are buying for because in Europe, there is no true power. So, we are not taking this. As far as core uh, product is concerned, we are definitely using our R&D and technology from here to India. As I said, like e-motors and everything, is, we started here. Now we are taking it from here to India because now the Tata Motors and others are coming up for this EXL and all. Though we don't have this manufacturing facility, even India right now, we, are, we have a manufacturing facility in China. From there, we are getting this EXL and all. Going forward, we are looking at it that we can have their our own building capacity or own manufacturing capacity into India to do that.
Yeah, uh, so uh, Rajas, as, as I said, like our core strength is transmission, chassis, and engine components. It will be still there whether it is EV or IC. So whatever and the true power is the brand which is majorly into consumables. So our focus would always be our core strength. We are not going to deviate because of this true power. We are not defocused about this true power. Only thing is the technology how this is in, evolving into transmission as EXL and all. So those are we are I mean. Uh, is, as I said, is our core strength, and we are going to evolve like this. And you continue to send we will continue to strengthen the aftermarket. Yes, yeah. aftermarket. So I mean, like, so only thing is that we are trying to provide now some additional services to the consumers, consumers, because the technology is changing. So customer will not be able to understand maybe the uh, garage owners or uh, so that is why we are trying to I mean rep expert brand which you have seen. That is our also our training. So we are doing already into India. We are training people on wheels. We have already done more than 8,000 people trained for Pascas, new technology. Similarly, right now we are running the CV vans uh, and trying to train people for uh, new technology, BS6 and all. And this we will continue to do sir. so. Sheffler motto is that not only to provide that product, we are providing service and help the entire ecosystem to exist in terms of product and services other than OE people. So that's the VLS motto.